So I'm inching towards the entrance and look at these wheelchair ramps. Well, this is the wheelchair ramp. These are the uh, stairs, but uh, much more elegant than the old wheelchair ramp at the old H Mart, which is around the corner from here. The mayor uh, noted in his remarks that this was once the uh, Valley Fair discount uh, store. It was a huge store. It was open for many years. He called it uh, almost the center of the community. I guess the commercial heart of the community. They're uh, sanitizing the handles of the uh, carts. Also disposable plastic gloves available. Even though it's uh, there's been an upswing in uh, coronavirus cases, uh, not much social distancing going on today. They have a loyalty card. Uh, you get 1% uh, back uh, after spending $1,000, you get a $10, $10 certificate. To check. Yes, sir, you can say. Thank you very much. Oh, this you have to check up the car. So, uh, to the right of the entrance, uh, getting rushed by somebody. In recent years, H Mart has added a lot of organic uh, produce, which is welcome as opposed to 99 Ranch Market, the Chinese supermarket in Hackensack, which has almost no organic uh, produce. Prices here, though, aren't as good as they are at Costco. For example, uh, a one-pound uh, blend of uh, greens, about six bucks here, about four dollars at Costco. Spring mix, 5.99. Uh, organic spring mix, $5.99 here, $3.99 at Costco. Put this bag of uh, Jeju uh, mandarins, or is $1.49, but it's $1.49 a pound. And look at the size, this is about five pounds, so... Jeju Island, of course, is the, uh, the favorite uh, honeymoon destination for Koreans. We love the jackfruit. This is a $5 piece here. My wife wants me to get potatoes to make potato salad for Thanksgiving, but we really don't do anything else, so I'm just here to look to see what's available. It's a very familiar uh, store from uh, the Paramus store where I've been shopping lately, the Paramus H Mart. is the newest uh, H Mart uh, before this one. Okay, I guess uh, they'll be running here and I haven't been struggle to get some potatoes. It's very crowded, but you can see how big this store is. Here are some of the aisles. They're narrow, like the ones in Paramus. This is a big surprise, food samples. They were suspended uh, when the pandemic started back in uh, March, uh, but here uh, they're actually handing out food to customers. Uh, I'm very surprised to see this. Here's the butcher department. Koreans eat a lot of meat, and a lot of it is very low quality. I'm not sure what kind of beef they have here. I don't know whether they have grass-fed beef or not. I guess uh, they're meat samples, and I don't eat meat, so... Apartments. One of my favorite items, the fish balls. But uh, I don't think they have any with eggs in them, but they, like they do at the Chinese supermarket. Here's the fish counter. Uh, we have the wild red shrimp from Argentina. Frozen, it looks like. Some snow crab clusters. Somebody asking for tilapia, which is a farm fish. Once you can get your fish uh, clean five different ways, six different ways here. The sea scallops, I'm not sure uh, these are whether these are dry scallops or have the preservative in them. They look wet, so they have prepared fish here. Just 
They fry fish to, to order like they do in the Chinese supermarket. Fried whiting, $12.99 a pound. That's really a lot of money. King crab clusters there. Lobsters, $7.88 a pound. Look at these snappers, $5.88 a pound. It's a great price. It's not the biggest seafood count I've ever seen, but it's uh, pretty big and uh, seems to have a lot of variety here. This golden papano, I believe, are farm fish. It's a product of China. The huge frozen section here, uh, not much uh, of interest. A uh, lot of uh, MSG and other artificial ingredients in, in the frozen section. Durian, which I've never had. Let me see if I have enough for a certificate. There's a food hall here. Uh, there's one of the uh, stands, Sang's Kitchen. The prices are usually very high, almost uh, close to what you pay in a restaurant, so it doesn't have much of an appeal to me. Big sale, let's see. I don't see anything. Olive oil, sesame oil. Christmas at a Korean supermarket. Goya products. I can't remember whether I have Korean pancake mix. But I probably won't be preparing that many times soon, so... Okay, I'm on the checkout line now. Eight to the length, not very big. Here's some pear juice. This is part of the food hall. Okay, good chicken over there. Menu Sandina is, uh, I believe, a ramen place. Uh, there's one in Fort Lee. There's the uh, Tule Jour, the bakery, one of the bakeries, the Korean bakery. Korean cosmetics store. My visit to the uh, New Age World Little Ferry is certainly welcome. I won't have to go to Paramus anymore, which is a small cramp store. And uh, I won't have to go to Richfield, which is a much larger store. Uh, not as large as this, but uh, very crowded during the pandemic. So this might siphon off some of the crowds.